Hello friends today I am solving a problem from the chapter design of shaft uh, it is related to design of machine elements so let us start with the problem a factory line shaft is 4.5 meter long and is to transmit 7 kilowatt at 200 rpm the allowable stress in shear is 49 megapascals and the maximum allowable twist is 1 degree in a length of 20 diameter determine the required shaft diameter so in this problem we have to determine the diameter of the shaft considering the shear stress and the angle of twist okay so using these two factor we have to measure the diameter of the shaft or design the diameter of the shaft so the data is given length of the shaft it's given 4.5 meter power to be transmitted that is power transmitted by the shaft that is 75 kilowatts see i'm uh, referring design data handbook by mahadevan and uh, balvir reddy uh, this is fourth edition so what uh, data you have to note down is according to the data handbook equations so in particular chapter in the data handbook there will be terms and uh, uh, related units so according to that unit you have to note down the data and substitution as well so next the speed is given that is 200 rpm shear stress and angle of twist next here l is equal to l is equal to 20 d they have given that is length of 20 diameter the meaning is this one l is equal to 20 d or 20 d if capital diam diameter of the shaft is considered as capital d then write capital d or else small d in data handbook this equation uh, small d is used so initially we will start the equation of the uh, torque to be transmitted by the shaft t equal to 9.55 into 10 to the power 6 p by n so the equation number is 3.3 a okay in the data handbook so 9.55 into 10 to the power 6 p p as it is need not convert into watts okay need not multiply by 10 to the power 3 so directly write the number as it is next n also same 200 so you'll get this value of torque next to find the diameter of the shaft due to shear stress using shear stress we are calculating the diameter first so the equation is tau equal to 16t divided by pi d cube that is equation 3.1 in the data handbook so after substitution you will get the value of d as 71.93 millimeter okay this is for shear stress sorry shear strength of the shaft okay next considering the diameter of the shaft due to twist that is degree in terms of degree they have given one degree so using this we have to calculate the strength sorry uh, yeah the diameter of the shaft so theta equal to 584 tl divided by g d to the power 4 584 tl by g d to the power 4 equation number 3.2 design data handbook so substitute theta as it is 1 theta as it is 1 and next 584 t torque available here we have calculated just before so substitute that value here into l l is in the condition it is given it is l is equal to 20 d so we'll substitute the same yeah 20 d divided by g g sometimes they will give if they do not give we have to assume it as 0 0.8 into 10 to the power 5 newtons per millimeter square we have to assume so here g into d to the power 4 see 0 0.8 into 10 to the power 5 into d to the power 4 so we have to calculate the value of d so we'll get d as 80.56 for twist so now compare d here it is 80.56 and here it is 71.93 so what we have to do is considering the largest of the two values obtained d is equal to 80.56 millimeter therefore the standard diameter of the shaft is 
D is equal to 90 millimeter. The standard diameter of the shaft is available in the table 3.5A in the chapter 5. So 3.5 means the chapter of shaft is design of shaft chapter in the data handbook is third one, third chapter in the equation uh, the table number is 5A. So find this values and thank you.